corner what kind of uh, way we'll greet each other. And it looks like it's going to be the one up, the one cheek kiss. All right, that's good. All right. You can catch our first guest each week as the butt kicking secret agent on ABC's Alias, and she currently stars in the new hit movie 13 Going on 30. Have I saw it last Thanks. night. Thanks. Thank You're, you very much. Now, did you know how to do the thriller dance before? Or did you have to learn the I whole mean, choreography? I mean, I remembered. We all watched the thriller dance, so it, it's pretty easy to remember. But yeah, we had a couple of serious rehearsal days. My co-star, Mark Ruffalo, bless his heart, he was, I was a ballet dancer growing up, so I was used to learning choreography, yep. and I learned choreography all the time, fighting. But Mark, he had a rough time. I had to give him some pep talks. But he was good. Oh, he was great. Oh, he did, I think he did a little extra credit. Uh -huh. Like, I think he was at home with his wife and his son kind of like. <laughs> <laughs> and you could see him counting out loud, you know, when you can see somebody like, he would be like, one and two and up and up and <laughs> roar. <laughs> Uh, now I gotta see it again. Well, yeah, of course. He's so good. He's adorable anyway. Oh, I like him in everything that he every does. Every single thing. But y'all are really good together. You're, uh, you're fantastic, and everybody's talking about you being the new big movie star. It's it bound to happen. You're, and I know you're exhausted because you know when these movies come out, you must be going like crazy. Well, the fun thing for me is that the movie is this much, you know, we're, we're shooting the finale of Alias, so we worked all night last night. Now, right after this, I'm going to shoot the last night of the third season. It's a big, great fight. It's so, it's so fun. So it kind of keeps everything in balance. Nothing feels too heady or crazy. Keeps everything in balance? It, it, it sounds like everything is just <laughs> <a> huge. <laughs> I mean, I mean, you don't get too overexcited about the movie. You don't, you know what I mean? Right. No, no, nothing's in balance. No, yeah. I just go to work, but yeah. Because That's you, fine. We'll leave that for another. Now, what leave is that for Oprah? For instance, you said you. <laughs> so so, so you, you say you work yesterday. Like, what kind of hours do you work on Alias? Do you really want to know this? Um, I. No, I'll leave it for Oprah. All okay. right. <laughs> no, that, It's just like, it's just, it sounds, it sounds bad. But I, I got up and worked out yesterday um, and kind of um, uh, in the afternoon. And then I worked from 5 o'clock at night until 7 o'clock this morning. Wait a minute, you and worked out and you did that? Well, because I had a fight to do last night, so I had to be warm. Uh -huh. Or else... I know, I know, believe me. I don't me. know how, I mean, I'm complaining that I don't have time to work out and I come and sit down for an hour. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and, and you're, you're, now, what, well, we'll leave that for Dr. Phil. All right, so. <laughs> I don't know what to ask you. All right. <laughs> so, but let's, let's talk about the movie because I really do like it. It has oh, a good message and, uh, and it's you're. It's fun, isn't it? Yes, it's make really you good. Just, happy and it makes you realize that that certain decisions you make are very important as, as right you're always you're always making decisions no matter how small they seem to kind of figure out who you're going to be you're mm -hmm. always evolving and it's never too late to fix anything right especially if you have fairy dust yes i was going to say especially <laughs> if you have fairy dust which uh you know it, it really is it's a it's a beautiful little movie Do we, it's, it's romantic don't you think oh it's very romantic yeah, yeah. it's yeah. And, and like I said, you're, you're great in it, and Mark's great in it. Everybody is. Thank Everybody's you. really good. And that scene, the thriller dance scene uh, <laughs> towards the end of the movie is great. Oh, good. Really good. Thank you. All right. So um, now this is, this is you <laughs> at, at 13, right? Yes. Are you 13 here? Uh, I might be a little older, but that's representative of the entire. Okay. <laughs> Tim Meadows was on yesterday, and he, he played saxophone also. Um, so, it's a fine instrument. Oh, look what you end up doing. If you play saxophone, you end up in the business. <laughs> yeah. um, this is the way everyone gets in, mm -hmm, saxophone. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, sax will get you everywhere. And uh, <laughs> a phone. Right. Um, so 
All right, so were you cool? Or... Yes, um, was I cool? <laughs> no, no, I was not cool, Ellen. I was a, I was a disaster. Uh -huh. um, <laughs> I was a band geek. Um, I was such a band geek that I started the pep band because I felt bad for the basketball players, and I uh -huh. was like, let's get in there and give them Hang On Sloopy, you know? Uh -huh. um, but I was a happy nerd. Like, the, bands, the band geeks hung out together, so we, mm -hmm. were, we weren't stressed about the fact that we were, you know, outcasts. And did you, did, well, did you date or did you... Uh, um, eventually, mm -hmm. yes. Yeah, when I was about 16 or 17, it took a while. Uh huh. It took a while to get that ball rolling. Uh huh. So but. now, because what's the situation where you were going to uh, uh, your first party and you were trying to fix oh. your hair? <laughs> when I was 12 uh, ish, I went to my first boy girl birthday party. It was Amy Fredrickson's birthday party. And I was so excited because this guy that I had a crush on was going to be there. And I used to sleep in sponge rollers, the pink sponge rollers, but I didn't have time, you know, it was the middle of the day, so I thought, I know, I'll wash my hair and dry it and then set it in sponge rollers and sit under the dryer just to make sure it's extra special good. When, when I took myself out of the dryer after three hours with like a tomato red face, and I took them down, half were straight and half were curly, <laughs> but like curly, like, you know, <laughs> it was, it didn't occur to me. I didn't know how to fix it. I just went, you know, I just uh, went to the party. Oh, that's oh, horrible. Oh, so sad. I just think about that myself that day. What a and you went to the party anyway with your hair straight affairs. and then curly? Straight and curly. Just oh. kind of like, Hi. Oh. you know. We played spin the bottle. Oh, Nobody no. Nobody wanted to kiss me. That's terrible. Oh. Well, we'll leave that for Queer Eye. But um... <laughs> <laughs> we have to take a break. We'll be back right after this. <laughs> Good. That's the extraordinarily talented Jennifer Garner. You, you're, you really, you're so talented, and everybody is just talking about how you're going to be the next huge big thing, the next big movie star, you, and you are. I tell you that right now. Um, so, and um, all right, now on Alias, uh, this you you hadn't even seen this. You were looking no, at this during the commercials. Um, these dolls are so rare. We had to get it from the guy who makes them. They don't. They are so hard to find. Isn't um, that bizarre? This is you. To see yourself as a doll. And Michael Vartan, your your co-star, and uh, you know him, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Uh, <laughs> that's uh, is your boyfriend. People know, I guess. Do y'all have a wheel like this at home that you spin to try to decide? Because <laughs> we, we can do help. actually. Yeah. Okay. Curtsy. We. I curtsy a lot. Uh, so now you're doing, this is, I'm just impressed with you. You just, you're, you're so you do all these accents too when you play this. this Languages and accents, yeah. yes. Now yeah. what, what else do you speak? What other languages? Uh, gosh, we've done, I only remember a few of them, like Japanese, koko wa watashi ni mukase te kurasai. How it, dare you? <laughs> um, let's, let's hear it. Well, koko da kata Really good. Thank you. What did you just yeah. say? Say it again. I said, uh, or Cantonese. I don't know what... You could be saying anything. That yeah, I was. Well, I was, actually. What I was did you say? Saying, I'll speak, I'll speak. I'm a tourist. I'm going into the tourist building. I, I was wrong, or something like that. And you, I knew at one point. You, uh, you learn this, and it comes that, that... And you hold on to it? You actually, no, I so drill it into my head that three years later, I can sit here and spit it out. Wow. <laughs> How do you say no sweet and sour? Mm, no sweet and sour, please. <laughs> very good. Yeah, very good. All right, so, and you're, you're going to work from here, and uh, where do you shoot, Alias? Tonight we're in Chatsworth. Mm hmm But where do you, woo, woo, Chatsworth. We shoot at the Disney, at the Disney lot right next door. You should come by. I would. Now, and also, uh, that's a great lot. So I, how do you get around there? What do you do? You, you walk all around there, or? Oh, my pink bike? Yeah, that's... I, I have a a pink bike that J.J. Uh, Abrams, who created Alias, gave me two years ago for my birthday, and I ride it, <laughs> I ride it everywhere. I ride it in wigs, in dresses, in skirts. Like, I'll just hike my skirt up and just get on that bike. And, and it has two bells and a basket. And you have, like, streamers and stuff? I don't, but I have been looking. I, I need to get some streamers. It needs streamers. But it has yeah. a license plate from West Virginia. It That's says, where you're from? Yes. Yeah. Well, you don't need streamers. I like streamers. Well, you don't need them because we got them for you. We stole your bike and we have it right here. <laughs> Ellen, thank you! Oh. It's oh. Ellen. Oh. Hello, Ellen's streamers. They're, they're Ellen's streamers. Yeah. And a new bell. 
That's right. Sometimes, like at five in the morning, I'm the first one on the Disney lot, and as the crew members start to come in, I've already, you know, I've already been up. I've had coffee, and I ride around the lot and go, "Good morning!" <laughs> and, and the crew of the the Pirates of the Caribbean a year ago or so, they were like, "Seriously, kiddo, we're gonna steal that bike from you if you <laughs> ring that bell one more time." Oh, it's great that oh, you ride this around. You. So we got Look your little streamers, these. and if there's anything else you want, you let us know, and we'll get it for you. Oh. All right. Oh.